Man, I can't wait until Thanksgiving. Yeah, no, I can't wait to get home to get some actual food. Yeah, I hate it for myself. But my mom makes the best turkey and I can't wait to go home. I don't know though, turkey kind of makes me sleepy afterwards. Actually, turkey doesn't make you sleepy. Um, but I heard there's a chemical inside that makes you sleepy. Like that's technically true, but yeah, I'm gonna explain it why it's wrong. So the reason why people believe that turkey causes you to feel sleepy is due to the presence of the amino acid known as tryptophan. Amino acids are the building blocks of protein and are extremely important for maintaining your health. Tryptophan is an essential amino acid which means that the body is unable to create it and we need to get it from the food that we eat. When digested, only 3% of the ingested tryptophan is used to create the hormone serotonin which later becomes the hormone melatonin in our body. Melatonin is involved in our body's wake-sleep cycle and prepares the body for sleep. Due to this special function, tryptophan has been used commercially in sleeping pills. So this proves that turkey does make you sleepy. Not exactly. Even though tryptophan is found in turkey, the actual amount is very small. According to the United States' Department of Agriculture, there is only about 0.24 grams of tryptophan in 100 grams of turkey. With other meats, such as chicken and pork having a similar amount of tryptophan, and other foods having even more, such as cheese with 0.56 grams of tryptophan every 100 grams. So to get even 1 gram of tryptophan from turkey, you would have to eat around 416 grams of turkey. Wait, so why do we feel sleepy after Thanksgiving dinner? So the real cause of your sleepiness is mainly due to overeating. There's also other aspects of Thanksgiving dinner that can cause you to feel sleepy too, as the typical Thanksgiving dinner includes many sides full of carbohydrates and may even include a glass of wine as well. When we overeat, our stomach requires more resources to break all our food down, which diverts blood and energy from the brain, causing us to feel drowsy. Tryptophan digestion is also affected by the presence of other amino acids and the presence of insulin. Since tryptophan has a lower affinity compared to other amino acids, when we eat a large meal, the amount of tryptophan absorbed in our body won't be 100% of the amount that we've actually ate. However, if we eat a lot of carbohydrates, that will increase the amount of insulin in our bloodstream. This affects how our body processes tryptophan because insulin transports large amino acids such as tryptophan to our brain. Therefore, when there's a lot of insulin in our bloodstream, the more available transporters there are for tryptophan to use to reach our brain. Alcohol has also been shown to increase drowsiness and induce sleep when consumed in small or moderate quantities. Yeah, so that's uh, why people believe uh, turkey makes you sleepy and why that's wrong. I do not just all that. Yeah, it's a common misconception that gets repeated, so while it does have some basis, it's just completely blown out of proportion. Well, now I got a cold back for Thanksgiving dinner. Hey, hey! <laughs>